So rest, curiosity, physical work, a chance to reconnect with big questions. All of this stuff that I've been talking about this week really has come together for me on the sabbatical on these long walks. This is the, the third long walk I've done. Um, I did the West Highland Way back in March, the North Downs Way with Stacy back in April, and now the Great Glen Way now. And each one of them has been an opportunity really to just take a step back from even the day-to-day -day life of the sabbatical and get in touch with who I am and what I'm, what I'm doing out here. Out here, I suppose being Scotland this time, um, but also out here in the world. I used to do a lot more of this. There's a, a summer when I was in high school that I actually counted up. I had spent more nights in a tent than I had spent in a bed. I've kind of fallen off. It's one of the things that happens when you have a kid. I want to figure out how to do more of this when I go home. There's only about five miles left, which means I've gone almost from Fort William to Inverness, which is across Scotland from east to west. There is the ocean. I just caught my first glimpse of it. It's about five miles that way. <laughs> this hike ends with a really long day. So I've already gone 20 miles and have about five to go tonight. <sighs> so one of the other lessons of, of these long walks has been endurance as a virtue. What Stacy calls the the discipline of walking, not walking is a fun activity for an hour or two, but walking is the thing that you wake up and just start doing until you go to sleep at night. No particular deep thoughts today. I'm afraid I, I uh, lost my wallet for two hours before I started. So um, not only is it a long day of walking, but it's also one that got a later start than I expected. So um, sometimes the lesson of endurance is that you just keep putting one foot in front of another. I'll try and get this uploaded um, tonight. It may go up tomorrow, depending on what the Wi-Fi is like. Oh, one last thing. One of the, the biggest reasons for this, uh, for, for long walks like this, historically has been pilgrimage. And certainly that was true of the North Downs Way that Stacy and I did walking to Canterbury. But this one too is a little bit of a pilgrimage for me. I'll talk about that more tomorrow. I'm going to Inverness and then getting on a train and heading north. See you then.